and then take it good and abide in right. your mind and when it will be like good and styling in your way, right. then you will be able maybe to share. But don't uh -huh. try to get someone someone right. will come with you. Don't, don't just keep it all for you. yourself. Exactly. It's, right, it's, it's about sharing because it. Because you give your knowledge and you're going to have lost it. Right. Anyway, this, this kind yeah. of things that more you give your knowledge, more your knowledge is bigger. You're so right. Yeah. You're so right. And 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 I'm I'm listening to you and I'm thinking about the experience that I had and why I'm doing this and um, the writing program that I started for women of domestic violence mm -hmm. and that's why I started this that's why I'm here today okay. and and exactly what you're saying is the same ide ideology about passing on the writing and using writing as a tool for healing exactly. and if I was assaulted and I just healed on my own and went away and, and never spoke of it and never helped anyone else I wouldn't be able to give and share that and pass it on so it continues to yeah. be passed forward and have you know and help other people so right. it's a very you know unselfish right and it's, and it's true because you say writing and uh, writing right. and tatao uh, is writing the spirit on the body tatao yeah it's the, etymologically it's the, 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 the ancestor of tattoo right? right because tattoo came tattoo because it was a misunderstanding from Captain Cook when he came back uh, after his first travel, it was in 1762 or three, I think. Captain Cook. Cap Captain Cook. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, when he w when he came in, uh, in, 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 uh, in all the Polynesia, and right. then he here he heard Tatao, and from Tatao and his English accent, then he met Tatu. Oh. Tatao is the name of a god. Of a god. Yeah. Tatao. I never knew that. I'm learning so much in this. Uh, Brief moment here. I love it. <laughs> that's that's great. That's something that come from the gods, anyway. Uh huh. And uh, the, the really first, the really first human who received the sacred tools were the Samoan in the island of uh, first day. The, 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 they received that by two women, half woman, half goddess, who was coming from Fiji. And uh, they first wanted to give that to a tribe in Savai, which mm -hmm. is one of the islands, but they refused it. And they went on the other one, which is a Bulu, and they gave it to the ancestor of my master. Wow. So it was a woman that first gave a tattoo? Yeah. It was a woman? They were a bit wild in the yeah. Beautiful. And anyway, in Polynesia, the, the women are the guardian of the secret. Is that because women are more nurturing and giving? <laughs> you know, in, there is a lot of future. No, but even, even in the United States, right. the Native American mm -hmm. uh, met the, the, the line of the family is done by the woman. By the woman, yeah. Because the woman that maybe don't, they don't keep the name or the surname of the family on, but they keep the blood on. They keep the what on? The blood. The blood, sure. Absolutely, you know, sure. The Jewish say, if mom is Jewish, you're Jewish. You're Jewish. Absolutely. If dad is Jewish, mom is not Jewish, you're not Jewish. You have to learn to be Jewish. Right. But because mom, sure, mm -hmm. papa, perhaps, daddy. You know what I mean? <laughs> right. Daddy is baby, daddy. But right. mom is mom. <laughs> and, and that's a genealogy term. And, yeah. and, and in Samoa and in, in, in Polynesia, Every, every, every chief of family, the father wants to have right. first a girl, just to save the world. So how, how many, since this is clearly spiritual and emotional and, and more about giving and sharing, the whole you know, um, philosophy behind it and, and the style, how many can you do in one day? I mean, it seems like it would be like one. Oh, you know I what I mean? Like it's not something it, it that you... It depends how big is going to be the tata. Right. But there is some rules, and one of the rules is you cannot tata, you cannot, you cannot use the tools when the, when the sun is up, it's not that. Then you can begin uh, the sunrise until the sunset. So you can only use the tools when the sun is up? Yeah, at the same. Oh, because, oh okay. Yeah, because one of the reasons too is that is a believing from another island. The, the Tao is registered by uh, a goddess, which is in Atepo, mm -hmm. which is the goddess of the dark side of the moon. She, she, she's the goddess of the moon, mm -hmm. but she lived behind the moon because she got problems. That is in Marquis. Uh, they got problems with her son, and then she went behind the moon, and, and then she's the goddess of the dark. God and that, that, oh. that makes so much sense. I and never knew any of this. In January, I cannot begin a tattoo. 
I can be. I have to begin to tell you before. You see what I'm saying? Right. So if they're if if they're out and they're in the middle of the tattoo and it gets dark, will they stop and then resume in the morning when the sun no, rises? They will finish. The They'll finish. Yes. It's interesting. Because it was begun before. Oh, it was begun yeah. when the sun then rises. Then the goddess said, "Okay, it was done." <laughs> you're okay. You're safe. Right. <laughs> you're good. <laughs> something like that. Yeah. Finish it up. Hurry it up. Yeah. <laughs> something. But interesting. But it's why in January, for example, I cannot take it after four here. I mean. Because it gets dark yeah. faster or earlier when in I the winter. Right. Sure. How many I can do a day depends yeah. what I have. Do you do you mind me asking yeah. how many you? She's one of the kind. My teacher, mm -hmm. the teacher I was with mm -hmm. about the marketing symbols and marketing patterns. Mm -hmm. uh, I was was like a naughty guy. Yeah, no, we don't want to grab around too much. Right. Wow. Thank you for your life. That's who you are. Yeah. Yeah. Because it's the oldest money I have to get to steal a lot. Mm-hmm. Wow. Well, we have something in common. My mission and my passion now, this is a new path for me, is to go all over the United States, start here, and um, spread the word of uh, writing, you know, yeah. as a tool for healing. I know, I know many people use it, there, you yeah, know, <laughs> it's similar, it's sharing. Right. We it's have like, that in common. And it's like, <laughs> it's like um, people can drive for themselves to make more. Right. Some people can, can. You're right. Whatever You're right. But I think if you want to know what the feeling, you know, this people when you ask this Lisa, she will maybe explain. Lisa, it. your name's Lisa. That's my name. Oh. Lisa, I don't know if she wants to, but if she wants to share this, I'm just finished. This is that. Do you want to share with us what it, what the experience was like or what it felt like? I'm still digesting. You must be. Wow. <laughs> and I respect that. I don't want to throw anything on you. Yeah. yeah. I'm still digesting. It was uh, a little intense. Sure. Because I already have the connection with him. Mm hmm. Um, that was another reason for that. Maybe Absolutely. Um, I do. So this is this is part of the, um, what was it? The, um, this is one. Sanskrit? Yeah, this similar? was the Sanskrit, the mm -hmm. one that we had in the beginning. And this okay. was just the front letter of that. Mm -hmm. So the lettering actually fits. You know, it doesn't matter. It's, right. It's, I just want to see. If we place him, we should be placed like should, should be placed somewhere. This we maybe have to shorten. Mm -hmm. That it looks good, you know. And then this we bring up, you know. So I'm just gonna. Uh huh. You would bring that up into yeah. the E. Uh huh. Yeah. Then I just want to see how that because we need to watch that it comes that it runs like together like that. Right. Know, one. And the same is with the chi, we're gonna push shorten that too. And then we make everything smaller, you know, it's just Sure. Uh-huh. Well, you have a good eye because I, I like the Sanskrit. And this one I was a little bit like, I wasn't sure, but now I'm seeing what you're seeing more. Yeah, because mm -hmm. if this one comes up and runs right underneath the E. It'll connect. It's It'll gonna connect in. really mm -hmm. great. And then this one, we're gonna add on and come up this way too. So this should mm -hmm. look pretty strong. I think we should shorten the chi. Shorten the P a little bit. The G and the P, mm hmm. Because it's gonna cut in, you know? Right. And then. What do you think about if it just touches the top so that there's still that link or connection? Yeah, we actually can do that. We can actually connect them exactly like mm -hmm. this, just very, and also here. What's your opinion, Mario? Do you think it takes away from it or you think it'll think keep so. it? It'll be, okay. I don't think so. Because it's, we, we're gonna make it fine enough, you know, like, like very, very delicate, delicate. The line. Uh -huh. The question is though, if we actually need to connect it in the front, then I mean we should. We should. You know, because if we connect it like this. So you're saying this might not be necessary to yeah. link them? Because then we link it again, you know, mm -hmm. because the actual linkage is made here, you know. 
Yeah, which is kind of cool. It's a natural link. Right, and this fits too here. You see mm -hmm. the H would fit yeah. exactly where this comes. It does. So, and then you have that sand script effect because which, which is really long, you know? Right. And we just make it very, very delicate coming mm -hmm. down, you know, that it's very fine. But right. Do you think if these are linked in, it might be too much? Or yeah. do you, th you think, yeah? Yeah, it could be. I mean, I could see this one running up. Uh huh. Do you like it? Alyssa! <laughs> oh, Pilimo. Pilimo is a very. Uh, How do you pronounce his name? Pilimo. 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 He speaks pretty soft spoken, so I was having very a hard time soft here. spoken. Mm -hmm. Very soft spoken. But he's also very. Uh, he's very well traveled, let's call it this way. I hear. So I'm gonna put it maybe there. Let me see how we can. Very interesting man, I can tell you that. Mm -hmm. Oh, I could I could listen to him for hours. He has so so much to offer and uh, share. Really get an education. <laughs> yeah, he's the person who's going to travel with us to Samoa. So. Oh, great! Right. Going to be a big experience for all of us. It's exciting. Now, will you take family with you when you go? No, no it's too dangerous, she's not, right? Yeah, yeah. She's, we never know what we run into. You know. Sure. It's, Something. How many uh, shots do you have to get before you travel? About 12. A lot. <laughs> right, I a know. Lot. I just keep on getting whatever I can. <laughs> I'm like, just give me whatever you got. Yeah, you want to be protected in there. I don't get any jungle flus or anything. This would have a pretty cool effect here, you know? Mm -hmm. I'll make that a little bit more. More round of one. It's come nice. Up this way. I thought it might be overkill at first, but you know what? It's nice because it looks like it's following a natural flow, natural line. Yeah. I'm like a kid. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> I'm getting so excited. I see you have your wedding band on. <laughs> yeah, always. Give me the right top real quick. The hard one, the red one. I like it out a little bit. That's nice. Does your wife have one? Yeah. yeah. Carol? That's yeah, neat. she got one. You know what? Um, it's always nice to see that I have the wedding band like that. I can't hide it, you know, so it's... <laughs> no, it's, um, it's nice. because I wear gloves. Oh, right. I can wear jewelry during our work. Oh, right, when you're working. Oh, that yeah. makes sense. So... She was able to fit Mario on her delicate finger. Yes, she did. You're gonna meet her, she's coming, actually. Oh, good, good. Yeah, this is where I would connect it. I just want to make sure that this... So I would bring it in here. And then bring yeah, this one yeah. up here. Connect it there, so. Alyssa. I know it's heavy. Can you stand up and shoot down? You're gonna have muscles. <laughs> That's a heavy can cannon. <laughs> Thanks. 
section like this maybe. Come around here. It's more open. to make that. I had a tree that I sketched that had, you know, the roots, and it was just like a real bare tree. Right. But I, type. yeah, and then I had some of the branches, but I, I used the words to, you know, like, make the branches. courage was the trunk, and then strength was one branch, and empower was another one, you know. But I wasn't ready to put a big tree on my body. <laughs> it just, it wouldn't have an impact if it looked like a Charlie Brown tree, you know? It needed to be a <laughs> healthy tree. <laughs> Bye. See it. Let me see it when it heals. All right. Okay. Okay. Bye, Lisa. <laughs> <laughs> That's a big one. You gotta get a you gotta get the necklace done like that, right? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that would be beautiful. Oh, you would actually tattoo like a chain and then put the the words there. Wow. Yeah, to put like a little like a line like this. Oh. You shouldn't have said that. That that's amazing. And then have it like connected to. Wow. I mean, maybe we could still do that. Like I want to see. Yeah, yeah, like put it on. Yeah. And then have a chain going around, like little, just like a, like a little bracelet. Br or even like this way, you know? Like if this is your wrist. Right. And on one side it says the lettering, you know? And right. then we make it connect to the thing. And go around your wrist, you know? Right. And then on the other side, you just have a line going across what has basically the links. <laughs> You know, we can see how it looks right. on the arm then. If it looks nice, we can always do it. Uh, Nikki, can you get me another piece of that, please? Give me another piece of that so I can draw it out. I think I know what I want to do there. We're going to be ending up doing a half-back piece on you. What's that? So we're going to be ending up doing a half-back piece on you. <laughs> Why are you laughing? 
Because that's, that's what's going to happen, right? that's what's going to happen, That's what's going to happen. She came in with, for a little wrist, and you're going to get a half back. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> Near Cherry Hill area. Okay. Yeah. You live there, or? I have a house down there, yeah, that um, used to be my dad's. So my brother and my sister kept the house. So when I go down to visit them, I could stay. But I live in Manhattan. Cherry Hill is nice to I mean, in the right area. Yeah, it is. So, so much easier living than New York City. Oh, yeah, New York is. They started building right on the Bowery. Yeah, that's a different... Uh, Different kind of pain, I guess, you know, it's a... Uh, a different kind of... Uh, disappointment, pain, uh, Yeah. Disappointment is a good word for that. <laughs> to say the least, yeah. Yeah, we, we had our wedding planned, and uh, just uh, does not have the ability to stop the uh, fuse, you know, it just goes. So. Yeah, that's the irony, Maria. I lived, yeah. I lived in my neighborhood almost, you know, what, 16 years with no robberies, no assaults, nothing, you know, feeling very safe for all those years. And now, I get, you know, the person that hurts me or, you know, is someone I know. So, yeah. That's yeah, that's uh, pretty, <laughs> that's pretty, um, I don't want to use the words, but... Yeah, good that you say it. You like that size? I do. I, I have a question. Go ahead. Was I totally off the mark by thinking it would be facing me? <laughs> if you want it that way, we can do that too. I kind of like it like that. And we do it this way. Do it back. I mean, I know there's no wrong or right. This is nope. a personalized thing, but I don't know. To me, it's, it makes me it's feel good you. to look yeah. at it. It's for me. That's fine. Mm hmm. Either way, it's fine, you know? Mm hmm Let me see. Mm -hmm. um, Nikki? Can you make me a stencil, please? Let me see that. I want to put that on there. Do you like it that way, Liz? Face me and then, right? She likes it because when I, when I show it to you, I say, yay. <laughs> then we have to put it on that it reads different. Coffee. I would love coffee. Thank you. Okay. you, you just, she's just a New York milk. girl, so she likes Starbucks. I like what? Starbucks. Not really. <laughs> she's like, not really. Not really, I'll no. Stick your down. How do you take your coffee? Um, just Lady. milk and one sugar, please. Hey. What Thanks. is it? What's yeah. your name? My name is Larry. Oh, okay. Larry. Larry. Lisa. 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 Nice to meet you. Yeah. <laughs> you want sugar uh, coffee? Uh, yeah. Light and sweet. Just like her. Uh huh. Same. Uh, are you coming? Thank you so much. He's a lefty? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Downstairs, I need a triple. I have no triple up here. Colors? So 
Darling, we've been in it. On the streets right now, so. What is that? That's the needle. It's a needle what we're going to use. And then uh, I just have to see how they. Uh, the lady was going to fill out a form, so... I mean, it's not going to happen right now anyway, so it's like... I just well, as crude as it sounds, if I survived my assault and getting punched in the head and thrown in the street, I could survive this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is going to be a different experience for you. you know, it's not going to be... I say I have a pretty soft hand, so... <laughs> You could go up higher on that uh, tripod, I think. Check this shot. It really means, you know, a lot because I don't know if Mario told you the um, story behind it was. Um, Unfortunately, I was assaulted on April 2nd, 2005, and um, I started a nonprofit organization mm -hmm. for women um, that are dealing with domestic violence issues, mm -hmm. and that's what led me here, and I researched and researched her husband uh -huh. and read about him, and it just seemed like someone that uh -huh. was an artist and cared about, you yeah. know, mm -hmm. beyond, or underneath, I should say, yeah. you know. So that's what led me here. Okay. <laughs> And that's why these words mean so much, because without the, uh, you know, without the being empowered with mm -hmm. strength and courage, I would never be surviving yeah, and, so and able to help other women, more importantly, yeah, you know. Exactly. I never realized how many women there were until this happened to me. And, you know, like most things, you don't think about them until it happens so to, you. Right to you. Yeah. yeah. So it's been a, an amazing experience. And uh, Rain Lake Productions has been documenting the whole story and the process, because mm -hmm. I uh, took the writing group and then I started writing monologues and we staged the uh, monologues. So we have a collection of women's monologues for this great performance and Alyssa wrote two songs for it. Oh, okay. Nice. And of course I hope that you and Mario come see it. Um, okay. We'll stage it again in New York this year. Uh -huh. um, we're staging it in New Jersey and South Jersey, like Cherry Hill. Uh -huh. It's really south of yeah. you here. Yeah, yeah. You taking shots? Oh, yeah. <laughs> She's like, yeah, I got that shot, damn it. But in New York, it'll be um, probably more convenient for you to go to the show yeah. there. If you're not in some obscure country or some <laughs> jungle somewhere, right? <laughs> He's the jungle man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Looks all right from here. Right. Yeah. Your first tattoo? Yeah, it looks tight. How do you like it? Nice letters. I like it. It's straight right now. It's straight now. It definitely is straight. I like that part. The way it links together, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He's ready. <laughs> you know, like the one that left? Lisa? I expect it like that. They give people walk in somewhere and just get it, you know? Because it's like there's no thought behind it. And like you said, the biggest, the biggest change is not today. The biggest change is tomorrow morning when you wake up and you go and wash your hands in the morning and you're like, this is here. You know, this didn't go anywhere. This was not like a fake mid. It's like, and I'm telling you, that's where the biggest shocks come in a day later. That's the tattoo hangover. Yeah, we <laughs> could call it that way because. You wake up and uh, say. When I started my back piece in Japan, I was like, when I, when I went back to the hotel, and then the next thing I was like, damn. You know, it, I was like, this shit is big. <laughs> wow.
I'm laughing because I'm thinking about my brother. My brother's ultra conservative. And I've always made him nervous, I think, from when I was a kid, you know, and he's, I'm thinking about him. He'll be no words, he'll just go. <laughs> he won't see it till the summer. Yeah. The crew. That's your back Oh, that's it since grown. Oh, that's old. beautiful. It's since grown. Uh, that's a great that shot. But that's it. Yeah. That's a great shot. That's I was young. Oh my god, it's an old picture. See my face looks so much. That's how old you look the same. Yeah, what do you mean? Yeah. Yeah. I knew that right about. away. Yeah. <laughs> I mean it's you can tell. I can tell my face looks, you know. Oh no, it's off change. That would have been the money shot. I'm awake. <laughs> I'm awake. What's that? Oh. That was the money shot right there. <laughs> My eyes got as big as this. Actually, I'm going to go closer. It's pretty high for me to control two cameras at the same time. I can, which one would you like me to just monitor? This one? Mm. Thank you so much. I guess I better wait. I'll wait till I set up. Thank you. Yeah, okay. just put it there and then. Put that on and let it dry. This is, this is you, black. I think that's more me. I could tell. Mm -hmm. I it. it looks good. You can still read, you know, yeah, the letters. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's not wrong. It's for you for later. Oh, yeah? That's for my mother? I figured that. What she gave me, like cinnamon? Is it cinnamon bread again? I think it's plain. I think it's a brown paper stuff. That's cute. So you need for energy. I said, oh, my. He's good. What do you think? That's. That's right. That's me. That's me. See the big part on wrist pieces. See we were talking before and some stuff. Right. It's when you we put it on when your wrist is straight like this. Mm -hmm. you stretch it. Mm -hmm. This comes up more because that you know I mean that's just so when you show it you have to show just regular like how you like would that. hold your hand yeah. Or like that. Yeah, because that's just straight part. You wouldn't do it right. like this. It's very when unusual. Like that, can you read it? Can you see it? I can read it from here. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I can. Read it. You like the bigger one probably because no, so it doesn't matter know. to me. I have absolute like I have no feelings attached to it, yeah. like like size wise or you know. I mean, yeah. It's like I think if this is the right one, it looks good on your hand. You yeah. can read it. My wrists are thin. That's why. Yeah. I have pretty skinny. I think it looks good. I mean, I like it. You know. Mm -hmm. I would let you know if I would say like ah I don't know you know it still looks great. I mean right. it's like the, the, the size looks great. You know. I like it. Alyssa, your opinion? I always look for Alyssa there. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Mm -hmm. She's got her digital camera. That's good. I'm surprised Jeff's not here. Jeff is going to come. He's stressed out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's really stressed out. My wrists are small. Yeah. Real stressed out. Mm -hmm. Can you get his friend? Can. Yeah. Can you read it? Mm -hmm. Okay. You want to have a sip of coffee or are you ready to go? Um, I'll have a little sip if that's okay with you. <laughs> Take it down. We're not in a You're always like with bags. You're always. <laughs> Good workout. Yeah. Okay. And what actually for oh, nice. huh? uh, uh, a and oh, 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 yeah. well, who, who, who you were talking? You were talking about them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.
Carlitos. No, I was talking about the filming guy. The filming crew is with Carlito and yeah. and Sir in the project. Excuse me, Mary. Is this for my knee? That's for me. Oh, this is for this you. This is for me. This is for me. This is for Sorry. me. You just have to initial here after red that we can carry out oh, in a casket here in the coffin. <laughs> <laughs> That's basically what it says. It's like we can take you out there. No, and then um, just have to sign a date here. That's it. Everything else is done. Da, da, da. Drum roll, please. Did you see the paper for you? Today is the day we will remember. I just need to know the date. What is it? 13th. It's not Friday the 13th. No, it's Saturday, right? Saturday 13th, 2007. We're good. We're good to go. Yeah, I, I, I produced the music CDs. Okay. And you are with them? He keeps finding Nick. I'm getting all the gossip. I like to hear about his girlfriends and his little stories. <laughs> Your brain. I like that. It's, like it's uh, Tibetan. I have, it's I have a little really, scribble here. I have fat knuckles. Oh, I gave you a halfway line. For you gave me a halfway, so you're not sure yet. <laughs> you're right in the middle. Like, yes or no? I'm not. I don't know yet. <laughs> we don't know. <laughs> I covered both. You never know. When I was a kid, whenever I had to get a needle, ow. My mom was That's in the different. hospital a lot. I'd go see her. She had open heart surgery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'd wind up, I was still married, I'd wind up in the bed next to my mom. And I'm like, okay. It's, it has, it'll be fine. It is, everybody you thinks it's the kids, same right? mistake you have. It's not, you, you look a little. Oh, because, oh yeah, if you can handle childbirth, oh, you can no, handle sure. anything, I right? I look in my hand. Oh. No. <laughs> That's me. She's like, That's me. Yeah. You're not married either, right? No. No, I can tell, yeah. Mm -hmm. Came close. Very close. What for be mine? Huh? What for be mine? What for be Mary? Me. Me. Uh, yeah, two months away from the wedding. I have a wedding gown in Lodi. Lodi, New Jersey, which isn't too far from here, right? It's still in the uh, salon. It's hanging up there. Pretty gown. Huh? Yeah, no problem. Yeah, I don't know. I can write up so down. Did you eat the cake? No. Nope. Feeling no lady. <laughs> Alyssa, she wants to get a picture of me. The first moment, she's like waiting for the first she shot. She is. She's like, you know, salivating over there. Yeah, she's out. feeding off that. She's, she's like, like, let yeah. me get that. She's going to put that. Let me get that first moment of pain. I know what it felt like because I had it. You know? It has nothing to do with me right now. Should I relax my... Just trip? relax, enjoy. How we say, relax and enjoy the right way. Hi. <laughs> I'm still here. Is that okay for you? Yeah, thanks for asking. Yeah, that's weird, yeah. That's a weird feeling for it, right? It's not really pain, it's annoying, but... Yeah, it's like, you know... because I'll wind up with empower. <laughs> so we're on the first word, empower. I'll tell you what, empower is a, is a great word for me. I'm thinking about the first time I stepped on stage and shared the words with the audience about my experience and my poem. And that was definitely empowering. Empowering. Sometimes it comes out like Elmer Fudd, empower. <laughs> um, 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 
froze and keep on going. Yeah, well, I'm afraid to ask what letter Mario is on at this point, because if he says E... <laughs> e! <laughs> it's like, okay... I'm actually slowing it down yeah. for that reason. Right. So it makes it a little bit more comfortable for you, you know? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Alyssa, why don't you go get your guitar and play a tune? If I had it, I would. You should have brought your guitar. I wanted you to. You're lucky actually because Norma always has a guitar here. Oh, really? I don't, know, I don't have any here. So, you play guitar, acoustic? Um, I have acoustic and electric. I usually write acoustic music. Right. So, what's the style you do? You're more a songwriter? Mm -hmm. You're in a songwriter style? Or what are you doing? Yeah, that's, that's what I'm doing. Um, but I like to think it's a little less bulky than so. Especially since I've met Lisa and been introduced to the women I've been inspired as a songwriter to have something other than myself to write about. Right. So usually you write about, you know, yeah, a broken yeah. heart, someone hates me. She wrote the theme song for the play, A Right to Heal. It's amazing. Yeah, I play guitar. So I'm like, yeah. Oh, you play? I play, yeah, I play guitar. I have a whole sound studio, recording studio in my house. Yeah. Oh, nice. Oh, wow, awesome. That's what Alyssa wants to build. It's great. Yeah. But you never sleep. Yeah, it's horrible. Nice. Yeah. It's like in one thing it's great, but in the other side it's horrible because you never sleep. You're always down there, you and, know? Yeah, and I, I dabble in audio and video editing, so I know what... I know what... You, know, you keep on going and going and going, you know? Right. What are you using? Pro Tools? Pro Tools, yeah. I use Pro Tools and a Mini 2 system with two G5s. Wow, nice. Uh, journey here. Good. And I see our show on the road. Alyssa's playing music. She's writing music. Each time she meets someone new, a new woman that's either a survivor or struggling in uh, violence. Good. And her music will inspire and empower them along with my words and facilitating the writing programs and implementing the writing programs into the organizations that help women and families. Yeah. It's a movement. <laughs> you have to make it a movement. I mean, it's a yeah. mission, you know, it's a mission statement. Sure. Mm -hmm. Rude writing. Mario, knowing that you have uh, a year and a half to two year wait, right? when you heard about Lisa's story, what inspired you to connect? Um, I mean, a big part of me is like giving back to the community and helping people out, you know. It's like when it comes to a point in your life, you make a decision what the next step is going to be, you know. I mean, I heard that there's a, a potential situation to help somebody move on in this journey, so I decided to do it as far as fast as I can, you know. I mean, I work a lot on cancer patients, you know, and, and 
trust me, they don't have to wait a year and a half, you know, because I'm going to try to make time whenever I can, you know. I can't fit everybody in, but I try to make it work as fast as I can. My wife can vouch for that, because I'm never home. Hmm. At certain, certain times, you need to know, you know, when you have to triple up your work. I'm not bubbling up, triple. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Yeah, make the connection, right? It's, it's funny because I know there's, you know, in our society, there's such a, not really a stereotype, but a lot of guys get tattooed because they find it a source of, uh, you know, saying they're macho, saying they're tough. So, how do you personally feel about men that hit women? Tattooed or not? Man, men who hit women? Yeah. You know, for me, if a man hits a woman, um, which channel is this going to be on? Because we, I choose the words very carefully right now, what I want to say. Because if I can say it to complete, you're going to have just bleeps on it <laughs> for the next two minutes. That's all I can tell you. You, you, can, you, you can curse. curse. Um, yeah, I, you just, can curse. I just think that it's, for me, it's, it falls under the same situation if a man is hitting a kid, you know? If you're choosing somebody who is physically, and it has nothing to do that a woman is not as strong as a man, but I mean physically not as strong as you are, it doesn't matter if it's a man or a woman, you should have no right to touch them at all, you know? And I think in this time and age where we are right now and you're still hitting somebody, it doesn't matter who the fuck it is, I think you've got a fucking farm. And a man abusing, nobody should be abused, you know, the world is abusive enough, so why you want to abuse somebody around you? And then, why you're picking on somebody who is a weaker person than you, you know? So, I think you should just be lucky that I'm not in the cell with him, you know? <laughs> That's all I can say to it. Uh, and you never know when you become a woman, right? So, whoever, uh, was responsible for that, so you should maybe double think on that. Yeah. Because it could happen to him too, you know, very easily. Yeah, I was very proud of my brother. You can imagine if it was your sister or someone you love, oh, you I know. I would be in jail. You want to kill him, I know. I would be in jail. I know, it's instinctual, you want to... My brother, I was so proud of him when he saw him for the first time, and I saw him for the first time. My brother didn't say anything, he just looked at him like this, you know. Yeah, we can send a message, you know? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you know, like they say, all my guys have have uh, some form of, uh, this is one's our, 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 our show is about that, so we have really heavy street credibilities in here, you know? Mm. And when we hear something like that, it's a big issue for us, because we just say, like, yeah, why don't come around our neighborhood for a second, you know? <laughs> yeah. And then yeah. Uh, we're going to decide what yeah. you, you know? Because you... That's really what you do, you know, you're taking somebody who is just not yeah. as powerful as you are, you know, and you try to think at that moment. Oh yeah, he would never do that to another man, or no, he would never like, attempt yeah. it. Oh, well, of course he wouldn't, because he wouldn't touch you if he would have, to, you know, if he would feel secure enough of himself, mm -hmm. and if he would know that he's a man in himself, he wouldn't touch a woman, that's just what it is. I think so. Well, you know that saying, life imitates art, or art imitates life. Yeah, mm -hmm. you know. Well, his character name... <laughs> I have to. This is sorry, I have to say it. <laughs> Finito? Si. Wow. Not at all. I don't hear any screaming Not at all. Here. No. I'm pretty good. Yeah. Hey, I, I'm. Uh, She's officially, uh, um, officially. A badass now, <laughs> right. because isn't that what happens? Isn't everybody who is tattooed just like some You just became a criminal, by the way. Oh, for the stereotype. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. I'm it used to my name be being slandered. Yeah, what you just became one it? of us. Let me just do something. Nice. No, I should have brought a bottle of tequila to celebrate. I didn't know. You love it, right? Oh, it's Cute. I just glanced at it, but I want to take the real look at it, you know? It is cute. I need to tell him, 
I think Alyssa's so excited. Look at her face. It's here. It's pretty good. It's here. It's hot. Beautiful. Just everything you want. Yeah, it's detailed. It's there, you know? It's everything you want. I think you're blocking Fufan's shot. <laughs> Am I out? A second. This around is going to take a little bit to get rid of, you know. I want to hit it with you all. Right. Oh, it's so nice. It's oh. delicate. It's what I want it. It's really nice. <laughs> yes. That's really your skin. Normal, normally, <laughs> heal it right. Mm. It's not gonna scare it. Okay. And I didn't think. Yes. No, because you were laying down. <laughs> <laughs> Don't kill anybody. Yeah, the three minutes. Yeah, so we got boom. <laughs> that's just. I had one. I did a like like a thing way 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 back in the days. Like one of our first it. interviews. Love it. Yeah, it looks great. It's like it has that sand And the way the E, the S, and the C link together, because they all are connected. Empower, strength, and courage. This is good. She's beaming with this grin. <laughs> this is great. Oh, man, thank you. You did a perfect job. Perfect. You were a perfect client, no problems at all. Thank you. So I guess it was a good combination. I get a lollipop now, right? Give me a lollipop. <laughs> right, <please. laughs> I mean, we have no lollipop. What the hell is this? Coffee. She's got coffee. Mm -hmm. You want to wow. shoot a picture with Quentin? Yeah. We'll just pipe it down. And then mm -hmm. bro. That you did? Yeah. Yeah, a, a, a TV station in Austria where I started. And I had a girl that tattooed a girl on the head. Uh -huh. And she got a big tiger head, right? Oh, wow. And I was working, and they were interviewing me. And she was, so they were asking her, so how does it feel? She said, oh, it's nothing. It's great, blah, blah, blah. So she gets up. And she talks and they interview and said, so how what's the feeling? She was like, absolutely gay. Boom! And she, she passed, passed out, out. Oh my God. after the tattoo. So I was like, okay. Wow. She was holding that holding that in to the end. Yeah. And then this is the Larry. being very attentive. This is Larry's job, by the way. Right. It's like he has to do that. I guess it's a training session. He's going to training. You go to training, yeah? Yeah, he's actually becoming a tattooist. He thinks he wants to be crazy enough to become a tattooist. Congratulations, Larry. I wish you the best on your journey. I appreciate that. You came a long way around already, then. See? That's how it goes. You didn't do it the first time, let me do it. Usually, uh, you're not gonna get any, like the letter is so little, you know, that mm -hmm. you're not gonna get. 
It's going to be fine in about two days. It's going to go through our ugly stage in about four days. Okay. Um, but I appreciate you doing the larger stencil and then going to the smaller one because oh, yeah, I, yeah. I, I, you know. Like I said, it's there forever, you know. This yeah. just stencil for me, took for a the first minutes. one, that was like a little bit overwhelming for me. I was a little bit <laughs> Perfect. Yeah, this is perfect. Wow. I knew Mario. I knew it was you. I knew. Happy I read about him. I read about Mario Barr. I researched him. How about the file I had at home? You would think I was like, right? Mm -hmm. It was like a CIA agent. <laughs> I was <laughs> online. I was checking you out. What did he do? But no, I did. I researched heavily. Mm -hmm. And I just kept going back saying, mm hmm. Yep. Where's Carol? Babe? Yeah, we're going to give it to you. We're going to be plenty. We're going to be really good. I'm going to be able to rub it in. Mm -hmm. Stop it. Stop that. Just look at that. Uh, non fragrance lotion. Fragrance lotion in there. Put that on the same way a couple of days. It's going to be like a little spray. That's what it's going to feel like. Okay, so two days of that, mm -hmm. and then I'm going to do a non fragrance lotion. Okay? And, uh. Carol, Carol, come to You're going to do it, yeah, like, like a QRL. Carol, what do you think? Wow, that looks great. Are you proud of your husband? Yeah, of course. Every day. <laughs> I think I think it's perfect. I think he got the size perfect, the lettering perfect. Mm -hmm. It was quick, right? Yeah. It was that bad? I didn't think. <laughs> no, it didn't. It just felt like a little pinch, a little yeah. hot. That was it. Yeah. That's great. You know the size. Yeah. Because I have these skinny little wrists, so I think nice. it, I think it fits perfect. Yeah, it's perfect. Good. It's gonna be a little stingy. Yeah. Many more should the first time. But that's like normal, you know, so don't worry about it. It's get a little reddish too. Well, sometimes. I won't take a shower for a week now. <laughs> ah, great. Right. You know, it, it's funny too that he said it. It's another story from tattooing. Way back in the days, we recommended, I'm talking way back in the days, right. not to put water on the tattoo. We said, don't wash it. Right. I had a customer coming back after two weeks if he could take a shower yet. Oh, <laughs> that's bad. I was like, and he didn't want to keep the bandage on? Yeah, one kept the bandage on. Imagine six, we, I think that's days. how we got the bandage off. Oh, that's oh, terrible. Oh yeah, the bandage can come off when? Larry? In about an hour and a half, two hours. Oh, okay. Explain it. Don't listen uh, before we give you a slap in. Right. After we have that round of tequila, then you know. <laughs> Make a celebration of unveiling again, right? Yeah. The unveiling of the tattoo. <laughs> Yeah, just wash it. You, you, you can leave it on up to 24 hours. So if you have something to do, you can leave it on. If you, if you go out yeah. there to borrow, you know. Right. Uh, sometimes sometimes it's better off to keep it, especially on the wrist, because it's so close. Yeah. Wherever you go, you know, Your you're going to be... Your bedside manner is very, you know, mild, and I'm, it's perfect. <laughs> gentle, but you're, you're a gentle project. Uh, uh. Yeah, it's better than rubbing on the jackets and yeah. the jewelry and, you know. Right. Right. And then I would just uh, wash it down really good and then make sure that you massage the green really into your skin. Yeah. Like don't let it sit on there. Yeah. Yeah. So much, when you saw what I cleaned up and him, the guy had a little film on it. Like, oh, yeah. like just massage it. In. The only thing you need to do is the first two days, you need to keep your skin moist a little bit. Mm -hmm. So that's Will it. Will it feel taunt as it dries? Does it get taunt? Um, it's too small. It's not going to do it. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's not going to do it. And then what yeah. you're going to see, it's going to come up flaky. It's gonna look almost like you're gonna lose black ink. Really? Yeah, because right. it's like your 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 skin layer, which has, has been penetrated, right. it's gonna renew itself. It's gonna come off, oh, okay. and then you know it's gonna form a new healing layer. It's like you have to consider this like a road rash. Oh, okay. That's yeah. just to give an an, yeah. an idea of what it is. Yeah, I've been yeah. Out. So if you have a little road rash, that's mm -hmm. what it does. It makes a new layer. Yeah. It, it gets rid of the old layer of skin. And then after the second day, just switch to a Curel or Lubriderm. Mm -hmm. That's Curel, it. Okay. And then you're gonna see in about normally this size, three four days, it's done yeah. completely healed. This baby one, right? Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. just, uh, if something it's happens, easy. which I don't think, you know, I mean, okay. it would be very unusual. Mm -hmm. Just call me. Um, okay. My phone is on 24 hours a day. Anyway, so. Thank you. Do you have my cell phone? Okay. Um, I don't think so. I think I'm gonna write it down. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. I appreciate that. I'm gonna write hers oh, down and mine. So if there's any yeah, questions, anyway. Do you want to see the uh, the yeah, trailer? Yeah, absolutely. The show. You clean all that up, and if you run out, here.
We had to do the official. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. You're going to see it again in two weeks. We're going to do that. I'm going to give this to you. Okay. This tells you everything we already told you. Mm -hmm. This is more than enough. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Right. Oh, wow. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Is that? The one you want to see. Oh, oh, okay. I, I thought you were going to say that was your slot. No. 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 That's amazing. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah, like a photo. Not he's he's oh, in training. Yeah, he's in training. And, and where's the other picture? One of my favorites. If you have uh, any questions, four months old. Okay. Right. He's got the Thank you. 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 Thank you.